We have practical exam day on a sunny day in July 2023. We are starting in Hofheim at the TÜV Service Center and we will come back here to the TÜV Service Center. We are leaving the private property to the right side. So we are in the game <clears throat> and we are going right again. We just follow the right curve. There's no priority sign here. So it was right before left. So we could just keep our right turn. Now we are approaching a giveaway sign. We are coming to a priority road, which is going from the left side to the front. And we are going straight, which means we have to slow down and check the left side. And then we go on. And then the examiner said, Bitte geradeaus weiterfahren. Please go on straight. The priority street is turning to the right side, so we have to check the right side. And here in the top right corner, you have a link. We've had a failed driving exam after two or three minutes and we finished here on the right side. So right before left, behind the last parked car, we have to move to the right side, checking the right side and prepare to pass the dark car, mirror indicator blind spot. And then, bitte rechts abbiegen, please turn right. Again, moving back to the right side, no matter if you go straight or right or left, Behind the last parked car, you have to be on the right side for the right before left. And another street from the right side, you can see the marks on the ground, the waiting lines. Nobody coming, passing a parked car, mirror blink up line spot, and we are on the, oh, we are turning left, I'm sorry. <clears throat> That's why we were indicating. And please turn right. Bitte rechts abbiegen. We have a parked car very close to the corner but still in the legal area you just have to keep five meters from the uh, extended curb stone line nächste straße bitte links abbiegen please turn left behind the last parked car move back to the right side right before left and oncoming traffic you need to check here blind spot and turn to the left side Halten Sie bitte neben dem dunklen Auto an und parken Sie rückwärts ein. Please stop next to the dark car and do the reverse parking. The area around the car is clear, so we can start the reverse movement. Because the first movement of the steering wheel will go to the curb stone, which is here the right side. And the front is moving to the opposite side, to the left side. So now you can say probably a uh, driving car cannot fit. Yeah, probably not. But if they go over the curbstone, which is not allowed, or if there's a bicycle, motorcycle or whatever, we just have to check. And because we are parking, we have to take care on the others. Okay, little correction to the front. Position looks pretty good. Examiner is happy. Student is happy. Instructor is happy. Bitte fahren Sie weiter. So, back traffic is clear. And then we go on back on the street. Nach links abbiegen. Please turn 
left. So moving back to the right side, checking right traffic and checking left traffic because only one car can fit. And from here you can see no entry sign. So he asks here links oder rechts abbiegen. Nach links abbiegen bitte. So he was waiting for us. Right before left. No problem. Oncoming traffic. No problem. Left side pedestrians. Also no problem. If there's no car coming we can also stay on the left side and if a car is coming we have to move back nächste straße rechts abbiegen please turn right Und am Ende bitte links abbiegen. This is a one-way street, so we have to place our car uh, to the left side. To the bicycle, you see bicycles are allowed to turn in, but he clearly placed the car to the left white line. Stop sign. We fulfilled our full stop and after the full stop we check left right side. And if it's free, we can go. Now we are on the main road and we are going to the highway now. <coughs> Gesundheit. Danke. We have a red traffic light. Oncoming traffic has a red traffic light, so only the right cars can have green light and as long as they are moving it's impossible that we get green light at the same time and if you see them stopping then you can expect that we get green light so you can prepare a little bit or you can relax it it's just a matter of um, if you understood the traffic light system and then it's very relaxing So back to green light and now go on straight to the highway. That was one part of the city. Now we are on a country road. I think almost everywhere, wherever you have your exam or your training, from the TÜV to the highway, you have a little bit of country road in between. Which is good because then you don't have such a big part of the city. There was a 60 sign because they sell some strawberries on the site. Bitte fahren Sie weiter Richtung Autobahn Frankfurt A66. We are heading to the A66 Autobahn and every Autobahn has generally two directions and here one is Wiesbaden and the other side is Frankfurt. And he said please go to Frankfurt. We will see the direction board on the right side.
there it is and frankfurt highway is the second street right so it is uh, better to keep right as early as possible that no one is overtaking us in the meantime he decided to go into the right lane early but uh, don't take the first right because it was written griftel the city of griftel with a yellow sign we need the blue sign frankfurt a66 Waiting time is good in the exam. Back to green light we are going on and behind the traffic lights we, sh we should start preparing the right turn because we are almost over the highway bridge. Indicating and slowing down for a nice right turn. Checking the traffic light. If you have the green traffic light, please do not break and uh, use the giveaway sign. The giveaway sign is just for the case that the traffic light is switched off. Now we are coming to the highway. Indicator left. And if you are parallel, accelerate to highway speed, which is around 100. Even if you see it's free, Take your time, check your speed, and at the end, you move out slowly. Blink off and smile. And whenever you see that someone is slower than you, start preparing, which means start checking the left mirror to see if you can overtake, if you can merge to the center lane. Yes. And you should do this on your own. You should not drive behind trucks or something like that with the speed of 90 and wait for the examiner to tell you, eh, please overtake the truck. You drive normally. Later, when you have your license, you would never ever stay for a long time behind the 90 kilometers per hour trucks. And then you show the examiner, look. I am able to drive on the highway. I can overtake. I know the rule that I have to be back on the right side. Fahren Sie bitte die nächste Ausfahrt raus. Bitte verlassen Sie die Ausfahrt. Uh, no. Bitte verlassen Sie die Autobahn an der nächsten Ausfahrt. Here is the 1000 meter sign. He's moving back to the right side because exits are always on the right side. Adjusting the speed to the traffic in the right lane. Even if it's less than 100, we cannot change it. But if it's free, you should have at least 100, 110. 500 meter sign. At 300 meter sign, we start indicating. But as you can see, here is no 300 meter sign. So we just indicate any time. And we still have a good speed. We check the right side and changing as early as possible. Uh, when all four wheels are inside, we start braking. Curve speed between 50 and 60 is a good speed. Then links up biegen to Königstein, Bad Soden, Liederbach. There are two lanes going to the left side and it's always recommended to take the right of two lanes because on the left side there will be the faster cars that will overtake us and then it's even harder to change back to the right side after we turned left. So we just drive under the bridge and turn right the next to Autobahn Wiesbaden A66 so on the other side we just go on here's a bicycle way crossing the the lane please do not stop for the bicycles here because uh, if you are 
uh, on your way to the autobahn nobody expects that and for us it was clearly uh, good to go and the bicycle way has the giveaway sign same thing indicator left and accelerating blind spot and changing out good adjusting the speed if trucks are there you should be around uh, your speed should be around 90 and because the center lane was free he immediately went to the center lane to overtake probably you could uh, take a little more time but he checked everything it was okay what a nice exam huh now we are just driving back the same autobahn it's the a66 and we are going back to Wiesbaden direction bitte verlassen sie die autobahn an der nächsten ausfahrt please leave the highway at the next exit some slower cars you can overtake and then if you reach if you're near to the 1000 meter sign you should organize to be in the right lane here one more car we can overtake little truck one thousand meter sign and waiting a little bit before we change the right side because we are responsible for the distance to the back car when we are done with overtaking it's not allowed to merge uh, too early to the right side we need 50 meters and if we see him clearly in our review mirror inside mirror then we can merge to the right side 300 meter sign we indicate here the speed is still good a little bit over 100 checking everything and going inside early breaking down 50 to 60 and enjoying the right curve fahren sie bitte weiter richtung kelkheim und hofheim nord which is right from here you can see there's a traffic light for the right turn with only two colors and it's off so we don't stop here and then you see acceleration lane indicate left integrate into the left lane even if it's free take your time bring up the speed and everything is fine and here is the strawberry street with the speed of 60 there are flexible signs if they sell the strawberries here they can uh, they can show you the 60 sign and in the evening when they are done the last uh, street shop needs to close the sign then it's 100 so if there's no 60 sign it's 100 three quarter of the exam is done right now you can see it by the time or it's more two third <laughs> so not many things to do let's see where the examiner wants to go but he didn't give information until now so we calculate that we go straight if we turn right it's the nearest way to the TÜV but as you can see we just go straight now you can see that we are entering the city of Hofheim you can see houses you probably cannot see the yellow 
uh, sign beginning of the city but it is on the right side before the traffic lights now we are inside the city 50 is the speed limit and we are on the priority road so we just keep going passing the parked cars enough space for two cars Another red traffic light. Bitte die nächste Straße rechts abbiegen. Oh no, we were going straight, I'm sorry. We were coming out from the right street, not from this one, but from another one. But in this exam we were going straight. We don't want to make it so difficult for the student. But here you have to find the straight lane, which is clearly, clearly the right of the two lanes. Please follow the priority road. So if the examiner says this, it's only going left or right and belonging to the sign, it's right to follow the priority road. Mirror, indicator, blind spot and right turn. And if you followed the priority road, you don't need to gamble what's the priority rule. Yeah, here is no right before left because you follow the priority road, you're still on the priority road. That's relaxing. If you understood that system, it's so relaxing to drive. An der Ampel bitte rechts abbiegen. Please turn right at the traffic lights. Pedestrian way is free. Give way sign. Nobody coming. Nice turn. And another pedestrian crossing. Ah, perfect. Priority for one street, just for us right now. Bitte biegen Sie nach rechts ab. Please turn right. We are leaving the priority road, uh, but we are coming from the right side of the turning priority road, so it's our priority. Und links abbiegen bitte. Oncoming traffic is free, so we can, can turn in, into the dead end. And what are we doing in the dead end? Exactly. We have to turn around. Bitte suchen Sie sich eine geeignete Stelle zum Wenden. Bitte wenden. Without reverse gear, that's perfect. One of the easiest things you can do for a turnaround. And if it's possible, and it was possible, it's no problem. It was a turnaround. Nach rechts abbiegen. And 
then we have a giveaway sign we are driving on the priority road so we have to check the left side nobody coming someone coming and going on Und geradeaus weiter, bitte. Please go on straight. Because the priority street is turning to the right side. We have to check the right side. Slowing down, following the right curve a little bit to see better. And if we have a free spot from the right side, we can cross quickly. And please ignore the oncoming traffic. They come from giveaway sign. Yeah, he started quickly. That's good. Bitte links abbiegen. Please turn left. Und dann die erste Einfahrt links rein zum TÜV. First entrance to the left to the TÜV service center. So just go straight to the fence and park the car. That was well done. Well done. This was another fast driving exam. Congratulations.